what's up what's going on what's popping what is happening my loves i hope that you are wonderful i hope you're blessed i hope you're having a wonderful day i'm having a great day i just been busting out these videos like i said if i got the same makeup on i'm sorry but who's gonna do all this again hopefully it's not bothering you so i have this video that i should have made like a month ago because i went to the event back in december and it's now january but I went to the makeup pop-up shop um, in New York City. And you don't have to have a license to go to this one, which was nice. And my friend Sierra, who also has a channel on here, I will link her or put a card up for her videos. Um, check her out. Um, she told me about it. And so we went. And I'll try to link a few clips of that video, like just like quick Snapchat videos at the end of this video so you can kind of see when we went, what we saw, who we spoke to. But the problem is, problem is I would like to start doing like some makeup videos and stuff like that because I get a few comments where people are like, your, your makeup is beautiful, but I don't feel like my quality is all that good so i'm trying i've not really done it but i'm going to try this year i'm trying to build the channel up so i'm going to try to do better makeup videos for you guys let me know in the comments if you even want them because why um i'm doing this for you it's really all for you so i have a little i would say a little bag but i've got a big bag here and thank god for these people because i was walking around with all this stuff in my hand and i was like lord i need a better bag for this in life um because all i had was a little crossbody you know you're in new york you ain't trying to have all that stuff going on no so um this stuff here i really wanted to get this video to you guys because there's stuff in here that i want to use i mean there's stuff that i have already used but yeah <laughs> there's stuff that i want to use and i can't because i'm like i don't want it because I want to show you guys. Anyway, further ado, let's get cracking. So, that big bag that y'all just caught, saw was from this place called Friends Beauty, Beauty Professional Academy. And I bless them so much for having that bag, okay? They saved my life. They have a website, www.friendsbeauty.com. And what I got over there basically was some eyeshadow eyeshadow i didn't actually get eyeshadow too but i got eyelashes i don't remember how much they were at the time but the whole point of going to this makeup pop-up shop was that things were much cheaper than normal so i felt like you got four lashes for like five dollars if i'm not co incorrect and these feel really good i don't know why there's no plastic on top of them but these are their 971s and guys, I'm going to warn y'all right now, the majority of the stuff that I got was lashes because I, I, I mean, I have one now, but I'm not really good at putting on lashes. And somebody was like, well, Tara, if you're not good at something, then you need to practice. And thank you for being real. And that's the truth. I need to practice. So I was like, in order to practice, I need to get me some inexpensive ones and some nice ones that I can practice on and these really don't look that inexpensive. I'm learning that I really like ones that have the very very thin lash band line because those ones are much much easier for me to um, work with. And here are 988s. Now tell me why I have three of these. I thought I got two of each or something but I must have really liked these because I ended up with three of them and I'm not really disappointed with them I can't wait to try them I really think so the other two here are all the same they're all 988s so no point in showing you that again but I'm hoping I like them because I have so many of them maybe I'll give this a, a set away in my giveaways because because y'all know I need I need to give y'all something. I, I, I can't believe I have over 100 subscribers. Who would have ever thought? Who would have ever thought? Okay, and I believe also from that same company, I thought, I have another bag. I'm sorry, y'all, I'm not on camera. I think I have another bag from them. Another something else I got from them, I thought. But maybe I'm bugging. No, I'm pretty sure I got this Z palette from their station as well, 
which I'm excited about because I believe this small, this medium size one was like 10 or $15, which I understand to be a very good price. And I'm excited about that because also from the friend's booth, I got two eyeshadow things, or I don't know if they're eyeshadow or blush. Um, no, they're shadows. So this one is a matte shadow. It doesn't look to have a name. It just says MS49. And I think that's going to be really cute actually as blush or a really nice transition color to like change from my same blush color that I always use. So I want to try something new. And this might actually be a very pretty shadow color. So I'm excited to try that. And this one's PS06. And this one is a pearlized shadow. And I've been seeing a lot of people doing like when it was Thanksgiving time, a lot of people were doing like a cranberry look. I don't care if it's Thanksgiving or not. I want to try a cranberry look. So I'm thinking that's going to be really pretty on the eyelid. Even maybe works at a good as a good transition color. We're going to see because I'm going to try it as everything. I might even try it as a very light cheek stain because I'm not really about that cheek stain like high volume. It's not for me. Um, but no, this is a Z palette in large. This is large Z palette and I think this was $15. But I'm excited to like depot some of my stuff or buy some single stuff because I keep hearing makeup geek shadows are bomb.com and they come single. And the lady also gave me like some little metal things to put in the Z palette so that the shadows stick. So that sticks to the palette. So that, that's nice too. And then I hit up Crown Brushes. They had a booth there. Very nice, big size booth. They had a big spot. And um, this is what I got. So I got some Flawless Face, face Blenders by Crown Brushes. I don't have a official beauty blender and I have never had one. And I don't use these a lot. A lot of times I just use my finger or brushes. But I, someone said that these are really good and these were only $5. So if these are really good and they're really only $5... And I like that it's dual ended so you can use one side for your concealer and you can use one side for either foundation or you can use the other side for your contour which I am loving so I mean it was five dollars so why would I not have gotten two and then I got the other one in black because you know those times when you trying to hide dirt <laughs> I feel like a black one is just gonna be a little easier to keep clean so I thought that was a good investment for five bucks if it doesn't work I can't even be upset. Then they had a 10% off coupon for crown stuff at crownbrush.com to use. I don't see an expiration date. So homegirl needs to try some of this stuff and go ahead and use my little 10% off. Okay. What else is in her? So of course, when you are in crown brushes, you probably should try to get a brush. So I want, I have a very little, and I just used this today, so I'm talking about me while it's dirty. But this is my normal e.l.f. little fan brush. And that's what I usually use for my highlight, which I love. But I was like, I really want to get a bigger one. And I love, I'm really looking into getting the Pinker Dot uh, brush set by BH Cosmetics, but I have yet to make the leap. But this one was super cheap. <laughs> it is so pretty look how big it is and I think the bigger ones are really good for like when you place it on there you don't have to use another brush to kind of like um blend it out so I think that's gonna be really nice I'm not trying to put this on my face because I haven't washed it yet but I can't wait to use this and now that I'm showing you guys I can finally use it and I got this flat bronzer brush from them except I don't know. I thought I was going to try to use this for um, foundation because it is shaped a lot like my favorite little e.l.f. foundation all-purpose all, all powder brush or whatever. But, I mean, I feel like it'll buff some makeup in really good. Did I just touch my face? Ew. Sorry. <laughs> and then, um, but, you know, if it says bronzer brush, maybe we'll try for bronzer also. And one of the major keys, major key DJ Khaled alert that I was looking for is this Pro Contour Brush. Like, Elf has one. And I believe the one from Crown Brushes is also just, Elf is like six bucks. And I think this one was six bucks too. I don't know if these brushes are the same price every day, but because of the pop up shop, they were discounted. 
But look, a crown bunch for six bucks, look at that. It's like perfect for that, you know, that contour life. Whoever made this brush up though, dope. You know everything. So I'm excited to use this. Excited. Then, oh, hold on, hold on, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna put it back. Okay. So let me tell y'all about what they gave us at the door so you walk in the door there is no like you paid for this event it's not it wasn't like super expensive but you paid for the event and you did get a free drink like i think it was like one drink or a free fill no i think one like drink and that was nice but then you walk in the door and you get this i don't know if anybody else got any other kind of next thing here but let me tell you something. Oh, but the bow is cute. Can y'all see the bow? That's cute. But let me tell y'all. This right here. And me right here. This right here. And me right Like, I was like, what is this supposed to be? This is called taupe. And it's supposed to be high definition bl blush, though? So, okay, I was like, maybe I can use it for, like, um, a shadow or, you know, some kind of powder. It feels good when you rub it. But can I tell y'all, can I get a hello? Look at this. That look like Ash Central on my arm. What am I supposed to do with that? Now, I am not a makeup guru. So, if you out there and you have this taupe hdb 22 taupe high definition blush from nyx and you watch my channel and you know what to do with this because right now i'm getting nothing like i'm getting nothing from this i'm i don't know what i'm supposed to do with this i might try this as an eyeshadow see what works out with a nice base if you have any idea because i hate to waste it because i stuck my finger in it and i can't give it away as a giveaway please tell me please let me know what you think i can do with this you guys, I need your help. This is a learning channel. We are learning together. We are sharing together. We are caring together. Please let me know what you can do with this. Because right now, I'm bewildered. I, I have no idea. Okay? So, moving on. I went to the Inglot booth. Doo -doo. The Inglot booth had the only one thing I wanted. I knew when I got there and I saw them on the list, I was like, I have to hit up Inglot. I have to hit up Inglot because, oh, hold on, guys. I'm sorry, guys. My camera is doing something funny. And if it cuts off, I'll try and start again where I left off because it's like flashing. It's been giving me problems all day. So, all day, all day. But, um, Inglot, all I wanted was this one thing and I was so happy they had it. And it was their... Ingla AMC Eyeliner Gel. Yes. Because I have heard that this gel is bomb.com and it is the blackest of black gel ever. Gel liner. Mind you, I don't really use gel liner, but I'm going to learn today. I am going to start doing gel liner because I said so. Because I really want to use this. And I hear this Inglot brand is dope. And they have really good liner as I'm trying to open it so I can show you. And it is number 77. I don't see a name. This is what it looks like. And it comes in a little pot. And it has a little thing for you to pull up. And that is what it's looking like. I really don't want to stick my finger in it. But I might just do it for you guys. Look at that. And it's soft. Like, I even went and, oh, 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 yes. Oh, yes, yes. Now I know why it's such a hype. You guys, if you could feel it, I wish we had feel a vision. Like, if you could feel it, you would already know. Like, it's so soft. Like, that on your eye. And look how black it is after I wipe some off on my hand. Oh, okay. And then <laughs> on top of that, as I'm talking to you, I'm realizing that this junk ain't even trying to move, homie. It's not even trying. Look, it's like almost smudge proof at this point. Like, it's not completely dry, but it's been sitting there for less than a minute. 
And as I tap on it, you're barely getting anything. I'm afraid I might not be able to get it off my hand, but I'm excited. <laughs> I'm excited about it. Oh my God. And I got this for $11. I still have the receipt in there, $11. I'm pretty sure it retails for a little bit more, but I don't, I don't, I don't really care because to me, $11 is a great price for this. And then when I got home, I realized they gave me two free things in my bag. Who are you? Where are you in in my life? Like, I love you for that. Like, you gave me things and they're going to fit into my little seed palette. They were like in my mind, in my world, in my space. This one is Freedom System. This is actually lipstick. And it's number 14. I gotta get me a lip brush. I want to try this lipstick. It's a very pretty color. It looks like it would be a very nice fall, winter, spring, summer color. I don't care what season it is. It's pretty. And then they also gave me Freedom System lipstick number. Oh, that's a tie. So the brand is Freedom System from them, I guess. And this one is number 32. Number 32. And this is the color. Also, a fit. like this one is in super pretty, like focus. Super pretty. It's like the sheen on that is going to be gorgeous. Oh, I can't wait to try it out. Okay, so yeah, I was excited about that purchase if you couldn't tell. Um, then I went to you know, you look at it and you're like, Oh, you went to Mac Girl? No, this is NARS. Can you see the NARS? I don't even want to throw the bag away because I don't think I have anything from NARS. Okay, I've not got NARS money. No, I don't. I got drugstore money sometimes Sephora when they have a sale or I got a sale coupon or you know I know what to do Sephora brand money. Okay. <laughs> no worries. Okay, so you know. Can you guess? Can you guess? I'm going to give you a minute. Can you guess what I got? It's like one of the top things that NARS has been selling out for like this whole last year. You got it? Okay, okay. Let's 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 see if you're right. Okay, 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 okay. I have the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer in Medium Dark 3 Amande. And who hasn't got to use it yet? Wait till I get to use it, Lord Jesus. The man at the desk, I think his name was Andrew, I should have a clip of that later, it was super nice to me. This, oh my god, I hear this does wonders. I hear some people say it's creases on them, I don't know. I don't know. I've never had a NARS product. I'm excited, okay? I can't wait to try this. I usually don't put my concealers over my makeup. I usually put it under my makeup. I don't care. I'm going to try it. I don't care how, when, why. But there is my NARS. Do I have that upside? Yeah. NARS Amande. Who's excited? I am excited. I'd feel better if it was okay. But, yes, honey, yes. I can't wait. Now that I've shown you all of this, I can put it away and I can start to use it. Who? Who am I? I don't know. Who am I? That was a little more, more money. That was $22.08 on a concealer, honey. On a concealer when I buy the $2.99 kind from LA Girl. Yeah. Yeah, it was a little much, but it was a treat for myself, and I and I deserve it. I work hard, okay. So Jesus is not hiring. Do not be judging me, okay. Um, next we have what is this? Who is this? Who is this? Who is this? Who is this? We have oh, they're actually the first people that I went to and this was their little plain black bag like bag that now looks destroyed but it was our Dell because I told y'all I need to get my lash life and I really this feel good I'm hot y'all these are just some brochures and packets I picked up while I was walking along that um different boots gave me that I didn't buy nothing from but I, this is the only bag I have at the time before I got my pink one. I'm sorry, guys. This 
This hair is gorgeous, but I'm hot, okay? Um, and Dara, my bag of lashes! My bag of lashes! I'm excited. I feel like I'm ready to have a lash drawer. And they had, I think they had eight or ten for like 20 bucks. And that's really good for Ardell lashes. And no, yes, I think I have a pair of Ardell lashes.